Hi, Psychic America. Hi. <laughs> this is Tracy Brown and, and Sean Little. And today is February 7th, yeah. um, 2014. The second day of retrograde, Mercury going to retrograde. I hope you're all okay. Okay, so you brought it up. <laughs> yeah. And the public doesn't know about Mercury retrograde. They're just getting used to psychics, let alone Mercury retrograde. I know, poor thing. Mercury retrograde. I think I did a oh no, I did an article on Venus retrograde. I'm not gonna do Mercury retrograde because it's just too So Mercury retrograde is one of those areas of our lives that lasts twenty three days. It comes four times a year and you could have car problems, you could lose your phone, you could crack your phone. People. Breakups happen a lot. It suffers with communications with people. Relationship breakups. Oh my god. Mm -hmm. Like I'm usually Bias, even with oh, your friends. Oh my oh. god. Like you could say like you could say to me, I love your blonde hair and I could say to you, What did you say? Yeah. Or I could receive what he says, I love your blonde hair, and then I'll go to a friend and I'll be like, He had the nerve to talk about my blonde hair. What? Yeah. And then I won't tell Sean, but I'll i I'll send him some shade. Mm. That's what Mercury retrograde does. Girls will break up with like their girlfriends and not, not understand the words. But what's really important is boyfriend issues. And Mercury retrograde falls around Valentine's yes, Day. Yes, Valentine's Day will be a Mercury retrograde and a full moon. So be very aware of your emotions. Moon, yeah, in, of in, Leo, in, in Leo, in your sign. In Leo. Oh my God! There be a lot of fights. You're going to be watching those up. Yeah, and a lot. Of we should hear a lot of screaming, public fights, public brawls. In I Leo? will be working at a Valentine's Day party, so I can't wait to. See Huh. You should have some fun then. I will. I'm going to. Okay. Anyway, so. we should jump right into what we're here to discuss today on the third IP. Yes. So we had a couple of topics that we could discuss. Mm -hmm. um, we kind of want to dive a little bit more into Justin Bieber. Oh, we are going to do that. Well, that. we kind of wanted to, and I'll tell you why. Because uh, <sighs> Selena Gomez oh, yeah. is in trouble because of Justin Bieber. And really? his crazy, crazy nightlife and his habits and stuff. So the question at hand is, we want to know: Is this going to just be a phase for him, or are we beginning to see the early stages of a Lindsay Lohan part two, but the boy version? So let's clean it. Let's call it. How can we coin this? Be this Disney behavior? This child be not Disney. I don't mean to say Disney. I mean this child actor. Like let's give it to Lindsay. It's a. It's a low hand. Let's call it a low hand. Is it going to pull Lindsay? Is it going to pull Lindsay? <laughs> Is it going to go off the low hand end? Is it going to jump off the deep end? Let's see how long Justin Bieber... Like, okay, I think what John is trying to say is, is this the beginning of his life? Uh-huh. Of his... Of his, of his life. I mean, is he going to kill his career before he really has a chance to take off? Like, here he is on He's the pinnacle. 19. Yeah, on the pinnacle of being a star, and... Like, does he have just way too much money that he doesn't care? Or maybe I don't he doesn't know. care. And he has issues with his family. I mean, he has all sorts of issues. But I feel like it's it just a phase, but his name is everywhere, and it's not good publicity. Not it's for the not. kind of tween market Can that I tell you what's happening? There are girls that are still supporting him, but I'm really surprised that the celebrities do not like Justin. Mm -hmm. I think They're Usher hating him right now. Like, well, Usher owns him, actually. Yeah, Did you know that? Yeah. He's under Usher. Uh -huh, I know that. Yeah. I want to say, no, you're making fun of like, like slavery. Uh, Usher, can you buy me? I want to be bought. Stop. <laughs> and it would be sexy. And I'm like, yeah, and I would, and I would give you a and whole CD for you. You'd have a whole, you'd have a whole CD after me. <laughs> Forget Chili. We'd have a whole CD. You'd be confessing a whole lot more with me. <laughs> this oh. always takes a turn for the worst. Oh. Oh, always. So, Justin Bieber. Justin Bieber. What is his name? <laughs> Bieber. Like Bieber. B -B 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 Bieber. Or the B Bieber. Bieber. So what I think did he I just say? Said Justin Bieber. Oh. <laughs> I butchered Bieber. That's funny. <laughs> All right. Hoping for the best here, Justin. I don't want to see anything crazy. Is this going to be the rest of your life? That's what we're going to look at. Can you come out of this? And I hate that you all are blaming hip-hop for Justin's behavior. It has nothing to do with hip-hop. It has everything to do with him. Not hip-hop. Love your spread. Oh, we're in a different room. 
because... Because the natural light is so much yeah. better. Look at my It skin. does! Like, right! It actually I is a lot look better. I love Like, but it's a, like, I really a, am scared. <laughs> but apparently I give off too much energy, so I'm trying to contain the energy so I don't affect, you know, others around me. I really do care about other people around me. So we're actually in my room, facing the opposite direction. It just doesn't matter. In any case, Justin Bieber. Mm hmm his mama needs to come, his mom needs to step in. I'm not reading, I'm just saying, his mom needs to step in. That's, his mom needs to step in. Oh, yeah, but there's, like, issues. I'm just saying his mom needs to step in. It's not good. I actually see him coming out of it, though. Oh, my God, are you kidding me? Yeah. He'll come out of it if he goes to rehab. Well, I do say that he needs to connect with someone. In order for him to come out of it, the first step of him on his road to recovery for me is him connecting with a very spiritual, a like, companion of some kind. Older or in his age bracket? Because well, I get a man around him. I just see someone who's someone that can help him and will connect with him on a very... And it's not Usher. No. It's someone that will also offer him, like, intimacy. I don't even know if it's a man or a woman, but I definitely see someone who is going to be, a, like, a soulmate. He needs to meet this. A, a soulmate will have to come into his, into his, into his realm. What are we talking about? I don't Sean. know. I don't know. Sean. I'm telling you what I see. <laughs> I see crazy. him. I see him. He's straight. I know. I don't, well, I don't see a man. I just, I mean, I, I, well, you see a man. I don't see that. I see No, I see an older gentleman that needs to step in. Well, I see somebody that he's going to be connected with on a spiritual. I feel like he's going to, this is corny, but I feel like he's going to meet his soulmate. I see love saving him. Okay. Not just a man. I see like a love that'll transform his his level of but intimacy when? and when? also spark his spirituality because I guess he's not that spiritual. So he's gonna he's go on not. this. He's gonna go on this he's like. Not. But this is all contingent upon meeting this one person. There's a one single person that is able to save him and lead him into a whole new road of success. But you see it in terms of love. Uh huh. I okay. see a, a love connection. Okay, and I respect that. There is a turnaround. The Queen of Wheel of Fortune. I don't know my own cards. Tells me that there definitely is going to be a turnaround. May not happen, you know, this year. No. I Thank you. Yeah, I don't know when that's going to happen because it's very contingent about a specific person. So yes, no... I agree. Um, it, it, it could occur after October. Um, I do see a man that comes in. Um, I do feel like he's Caucasian, so that's why I don't think it's uh, Usher. Um, Usher is kind of selfish <laughs> and cares about himself. And he has the voice to worry about right now, so he he would rather Justin quiet it down, maybe stay in Canada, let him get through the voice, and then he'll try and deal with him. That's selfish energy to me. I'm sorry, Usher, is the way I'm reading the, the cards. You know, I'm not calling you out the cards are. With that being said, this kid is lost, so. Mm -hmm. Yes, I mean, he is. Until he meets, I, that's why I was like, I yes. love will save him. A real love. So I feel like he hasn't really ever had that. Yes. Not even really with Selena. Like, everything else, everything he's been through has just been kind of like... Yes. Whatever, but a real love. Now, I can tell you that he's... I don't know if he's reconnecting with his dad or something to that effect. It actually could be father energy that I'm getting. Because um, I'm getting somebody Caucasian, somebody that's emotionally responsible, emotionally connected to him. Somebody that probably has their own addiction issues, maybe drinks way too much. Mm -hmm. um, but coming to a place of, like... Don't turn out like me, which is why I'm kind of getting maybe daddy energy. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, maybe that's what that is. Yeah, that's, yeah, yeah. exactly. Mm -hmm. But it's emotionally connected yeah. to Justin. Yeah. Um, drugs is big with Justin. So he needs to clean up his act. No one is addressing it. Um, I kind of see him in rehab. Yeah, I see that. Okay. Um, it's interesting that you talked about love because I think you're right. My love is card is showing up. Mm -hmm. I think he's going to wind up still being torn, 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 torn between his love for Selena mm -hmm. and somebody else coming through. But this other person is like the soulmate. Like I see him meeting his soulmate. And you're, you absolutely could be right. Like mm -hmm. this is probably, I, I equate Justin and Selena to Chris Brown and Rihanna. Mm -hmm. That youthful, passionate, strong connection, but what is it? Also, just like those, ten years those from now, unions just remind me of two stars colliding. Like this, it's not yeah. like they met before they were famous. 
and then be fell in love. No, right. they were just like two stars that collided. Like they were in the right. same scene, the same time, same place. Yes. And yes. it's just like the next step. I'm sure they have their publicist saying, "Oh my god, this would be amazing for you too if you were to sell this." You know, I'm talking about someone that's literally going to be an under the radar. All American, like I, he'll probably meet her at like a state fair or something, like that kind of love. That oh, just I love up. when you're specific like that at a state fair. Yeah, that's what I, that's what I see. Um, like that. I'm getting victory, victory, for him. Mm-hmm. So I feel like people are going to say, "Oh my God, Justin did it! He conquered, you know, drug abuse." Da 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 da. I'm also getting that it's an illusion. Mm-hmm. I'm getting that there's going to be some pain. Um, and that the, 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 the ability to spiral back down comes up again. So, I think he's back and forth. Yeah. I just don't see... Well, I mean, I don't see anything happening until he meets the love, and then everything can go upward. When do you think you see the love? <sighs> that I don't know. Okay. That is, that is the only unclear thing. Okay. I don't think it's going to be this year. I think it's going to look like havoc oh. for the whole year. Um, and until he agrees to give up his lifestyle, and go on this new journey, which I agree with Sean, it actually has to be a spiritual kundalini, a mm-hmm. come-to-me-Jesus mm-hmm. moment. Mm-hmm. Um, it, it, he, rides, he rides the waves. Yeah. You know, and he's up, he's down. Oh, my God, he cleaned up. Oh, my God, he maybe he didn't. Yeah, it's going to take a minute. I see, before he even meets her, like, I was like, okay, well, what do what could I see? Slowing down, a lot of alone time, a reawakening of himself, okay. then meeting. And we, you, can you you think you can? You know what I do I sometimes in, like two years. in a, two years. Okay, because definitely not this year, and definitely I actually got year. next year. Mm-hmm. Um, and just so you know, so you can start practicing for future. I read these for guidance. For the future. Oh, that's an idea. Yeah, yeah. Practice for for the future. Mm-hmm. Um, Okay, we're, we're going to agree to two years. Yeah, I think two years. Because I, I, I pulled this as like a prerequisite, like a precursor. So. Let's just remember it, it absolutely is going to take a minute. In any case, we're out. Justin Bieber, we're praying for you. Yeah. Because and you're young. And so we love you because you're young. I don't love, 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 love you. You know, I love my grandbaby. But I love you because you're 19 years old and, you, you know, you can conquer the world and I want that for you. Mm-hmm. Today's February 7, 2014. This is Tracy Brown. This is Sean Little, and that's how we TMC it. And this has been, oh, we don't have our sign. This has been the third eye view. Um, we're reading more than just a tablet, and tune in next week. Please call us for your personal readings. Oh, right, that's What too. are we here for? At the Green Man Store, 818 985 2010. Join me on Twitter, join me on Facebook at Psychic Tracy Brown. Google us. Google us. Oh, by the way, if you Google me, Google me, you got to put in psychic something somewhere. Um, thank you. All right. It's been a pleasure. See you next week. Bye. Bye.